Capture lets you create a multitude of different reports. This is done from the Reports category in the Design tab. By pressing the Add button, Capture shows you a number of reports templates to start off from. I'm going to choose the Equipment report as a starting point. Next, I press the Edit button to open the Report Editor, where the left-hand side is a preview of the report, and the right-hand side is where we can modify it. Let's start with taking a look at the columns in the fixtures table of this report. If we want to add a column, right-click on Columns, select Add Columns, and choose the column you want to add. I'm going to add the patch column. This has appeared at the end of the report. Next, I would like to remove the Optics column, which I can do by selecting the column and pressing the Remove button. Finally, let's move the Weight column to the end of the table by right-clicking and moving it down in the list here. This moves it to the right in the report table. If you need more space on the paper for all your columns, it's good to know that you can modify the paper in the page setup where you have a number of different paper sizes and orientations to choose from, as well as the ability to enter a custom paper size as well. There are also some options available that affect the entire report. And they're available under the report in the tree here. Here we have things such as the text that appears at the top of the report, the ability to filter the contents of the report using a filter in the project, as well as choosing whether you want page breaks inserted between every table in the report or not. Note that some information in the report here actually comes from the project section of the design tab where the text here is shared throughout all the reports and plots in your design. Thank you for watching.